So who's here? A special guest, Rishi Rai. So yes, friends, if you haven't watched our videos, earlier videos, and you don't know who this guy is, this is our son, Rishi. And he's having his finals. And today's topic will be connected to that. And here it says, every exam preparation ever. But before we go ahead and watch this, yes, friends, if you're watching us for the first time, subscribe. Click the bell icon to get notified of all the videos as soon as we upload them. And after watching this video, if you like it, click on the like button and share this video with your friends and family. Now, friends, this is talking about every exam preparation ever. So Rishi is also preparing for exams. And I'm going to share with you something really special. This is what I saw when I went up to check on him and see, is he studying? And watch this video and see what he was actually doing. Wait, wait what? <laughs> what? Yeah, so let's see whether this was same as what you were doing or not. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> he already knows. So guys, let's watch this. No, why? <laughs> so this is what, guys, we saw him doing. But I should say, I saw him doing when I went to his room. Why? So the table, Rishi, watch. The table should be down you. on your book. With your book, you should be showing. studying. And this is what he was doing when I went there. static electricity. He was showing us static electricity. <laughs> and look at the flowers that he's making. Now he's Flap. rubbing. <laughs> yes, he's I rubbing. And he's saying, oh, it's quite, I need to make more static electricity. <laughs> look at that. Look at his hair. Rishi, Stop. Look. Look. Stop. <laughs> And Dara, you watch. You're so proud of your son. Watch, this is what he's doing when his finals are. Yeah, this is the science experiment. Yes, this is a science experiment. <laughs> but watch how your hair are also dancing. <laughs> he's got his pencil also in his hand. His pen, to show that he's actually studying. <laughs> you just stop. Why? Why do you do this? <laughs> No. So this is what American Indian kids do. What no. Indian American kids do. Or I should say my Saput does. No, stop. Watch, watch. No, watch. Look at yourself. Stop it. Isn't I, it great? I was showing you. Why are you recording it? <laughs> Why is trying to show me that he can do all these various tricks with his <laughs> So guys, this is what our son does for preparation for exams. Now let's watch this video and see are these kids no, like him kids. better no, than no, him no. or not? No. 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 <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and watch this video. <laughs> Look at the number of books he has to study. Shit! Exam is a teacher to watch Bye bye, I will not say. My ass can't relax. All of chemistry, chemistry. All of maths, 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 maths. Evis, Evis, Evis. He's got only 500 rupees. Oh, yes, I mean, Panzerox milling again. He's saying make copies, five copies because he doesn't have any. Give, give the copies of the money. <laughs> Hello. 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 See, in India you have to memorize periodic table. Oh, what a technique! 
Rabbi. <laughs> what are you saying? Trying to memorize the product table, no? H N K N like that. Like you do. Holy Pena Shakar Ke Rabbi Nechabaskuka 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 Holy Pena Shakar Ke Rabbi No breathing. You're wasting time. <laughs> you just eat all day long. You just breathe all day long. Stop breathing. You get oh, no, 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 no. Why should you do that? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> what was that? Prashad. Bhagwan ji ka. So friends, this was funny and you have to decide are these guys worse or better than Rishi in better. exam preparation? I was better. You were better? How? I don't know. How you don't know. know? It's to rule. <laughs> okay. But at least they have, you know, when they showed where he was making photocopies of all the notes, <laughs> asked his friend for notes. Can you just take pictures of it though? Probably, but at our time, uh, yeah, of how many pages? there were lots of me, right? And it would be small screen. Yeah. But this reminded me that when I used to be in college and before the exams, I used to take notes of other, or, uh, my other Are friends. Are you telling me you didn't make your notes? I used to, but if I used to be absent a lot. So I used to then tell them, okay, you know, for these, these subjects, do you have notes? And I would also take notes because I would see 
Have I missed any while I was making it? You would take notes from their notes. Yeah. So basically, you're taking notes. Of I would have my notes. notes. No, I would have my notes, <laughs> and then I would take their notes also to match. Is there any part that I missed while writing my notes? So, so let's say, so let's say I would you have take both of you wrote something different. Then what did you do? Then I take both of them and I memorize both of those. No, things. no, what is your different exact opposites of oh, the same? Oh, that thing. can't happen because you're in the class. How do you know? But anyway, <laughs> he's going off topic <laughs> as usual. So, so I see. used to, guys, take the notes and mm-hmm. I used to take go to this uh, photocopy place in our college. And I would make photocopies of all the notes, their whole big, you know, copies that they used to have. They were kind of registers, kind of ones. So this reminded me my of my time, and um, yes, that's how it is. And they made it in a hilarious way. Yeah. So with Rishi, have you ever done any of these? No. Is your mom better than this mom? No. He's always going to say <laughs> that. But I got a very when they were showing that dad. Where the dad was like, where even when the kid was eating food, he was like, <laughs> study and then yeah, study, the, stop breathing, study, you waste your time breathing, die. <laughs> so it was. I was like, you know, I need to do that with Rishi. Oh yes, yeah, because stop I do do it to stop, some extent, stop, stop but I need to go one step ahead. Yeah, what do you stop, say, Dad? Yeah, no, stop think, breathing. Uh, yeah, I mean, if Rishi, if you tell him to, you know, stop eating, he will stop immediately because normally people have to tell him the opposite. Like, yeah. Please eat, please eat, please eat. So in our cases, it's opposite. I mean, if you tell him not eat, he'll be like, well, cool, man. Let's not eat. So he'll be, so it's the opposite thing. But uh, it was nice to, nice to see this video. And uh, and normally, I think the notes and stuff, I, I, I think it's better to, when the teacher is... Uh, teaching something it is better to understand that concept there itself rather than take notes and then come home and then review from the notes because then it's double work i mean number one you did not pay attention to what the teacher was saying then you came back and you opened the notes and then you only have notes that you could copy and then it becomes very difficult to understand so in my case the trick was to basically try to understand it there itself and if you didn't get it, then you raise your voice and uh, uh, try to make the teacher understand you there. Or if that doesn't work, then you go to the teacher after the class or whatever. But notes work only came in the end when you had understood everything. And of course, the guy who's trying to understand is not able to note much down. So the only hope is that there is some sort of book or something from where you can, you know, uh, look. But but I would say that in my time, the education system was uh, frankly not so good in the sense that you could only do one thing. I mean, if you understand the teacher, the notes are gone. If you take the notes and you can't understand properly. So there's always a problem, big problem. And it, and it at least in my time, I could see that the whatever the teachers were teaching was not in any book uh, in, in any particular way. So the uh, books are just going doing something else. The teacher is teaching something else. And the actual exam that comes is kind of in between all those things. So it was a kind of weird way. But I would say in the US it is more now in the US because I don't know. I mean everywhere now after 20-25 years everything would have gotten great. But here I would say it's a little bit more uh, you know, um, digitized. So everything has been digitized and you they have made a website, you go there, you download a bunch of stuff. So you don't have to make any notes. They have already digitized it. The teacher has put their notes in there in a way. They are essentially PDF files. They've already put stuff for you that you can review. They've already made some PPTs for you that you can do. So you don't have to really put down the notes. So the focus of the child in the class will primarily be understanding the concept and then I would say it has certainly come a long way and become a much better process. So let's ask Rishi. So Rishi, uh, you don't write notes, do you? No. Yeah, so (laughs) it looks like no notes for the kids here. And uh, how good is your preparation for the examination? Very good. (laughs) (laughs) Look at this genius kid. His preparation is very good and the... And the proof of how good his preparation was in this video. And we showed that to you in the beginning. Yeah. So now we wait for his results, guys. And we'll share that also no. to you. No. <laughs> no. So, okay, guys. We hope you liked our video today. And we'll take your leave. And we'll come back again in another video very soon. Till then, take care. And bye-bye. Oh, and if you're new to my channel... Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit the bell icon 
so it notifies you when I put in my new video for you to enjoy. Bye!